In Manatee County, FPNL is unveiling the world's largest solar powered battery. It's coming at a time when energy providers are looking to solar systems to help with clean energy solutions. 10 Tampa Bay's Adore Chumba gives us a look. Right behind me is a $300 million battery here at the Manatee Energy Storage Center. It sits right next to the solar panels and has a 409 megawatts capacity. But what exactly does that mean for the average energy user? It has the capacity to store enough energy to power 329,000 homes for more than two hours. Uh, and it's also equivalent to 100 million iPhone batteries, which is nearly all the iPhones in the United States. Manatee County has three solar energy centers and one more on the way. And now it's home to the largest solar power battery in the world. The battery will produce energy for Florida customers, making it possible to store solar power generated during the day to be used at night or in the future. How big of an energy storage facility is this that we're talking about? So this, this facility is made up of 132 uh, energy storage containers organized across a 40 acre plot of land. It's all part of an ongoing and evolving effort to diversify energy production and do away with fossil fuels and instead generate green energy to help combat climate change. We estimate that's going to save customers $50 million. Um, we also estimate it's going to eliminate 1 million tons of carbon dioxide emissions. The battery removes the need to run oil in the old generators for electric power. The initial plan was to tear the generators down, but it's now going to stay up for now as a backup plan. Out of an abundance of caution, we just want these things in our back pocket in case we were to experience extreme winter weather like what was experienced in Texas. Solar energy has become more popular and cheaper and is gaining wider commercial viability because it has zero carbon emissions. Critics say in the long run, it benefits human health and the planet. This project's really a win-win for, for the environment. FPL began the year by closing its last coal plant in Florida. Currently, there are 42 solar energy centers operating across more than 20 counties.